Come on, mate. Hello. He's a pink soldier. It's dear old pinky soldier. Have we started? Um, we haven't done this for a while. So what happens then? Are you keeping those things on? No, not for me, actually. Much too hot. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. I've changed. I'm not sure how realistic my eyes are. I'm in a mystery location. The time here is different. We'll say that much. Do, do you oh, know boy. where he is, Timmy? I happen to know where he is because I um, found out. Wouldn't mind you guessing and me giving you clues with my face. All right, I'll go to Dubai. I haven't done my face yet. I'm doing an impression of the person, people from that country. We'll do it again. Not the, not the dear old Swiss, is it? <sighs> not far off. Look closer. Stern. Stern, big rules. Singapore. Just trying to get some more light. That's just a sort of... Well, do you want to see my bathroom? Yes. Boo, 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 boo. There you go. Tell you what, there's not many people who light a room by... Um, well, to be fair, just opening another room. No, well, there's not many people like Mark Watson, and that's the God's honest truth. Well, there is. There's Badil. Ben Moore. Yeah. And that um, the one from the band... I'm, I'm, I'm starting to itch to get going. Ah. I'm also, ready to... Um, what, what, what more? I'm ready to chuck it down. Yeah, I, I got concussion at 4 p.m. this afternoon. You go, keep to start. Concussion for horn, is it? Yeah. No, not concussion. Um, ice cream? I had an ice cream. You're right. I, gen I genuinely thought he was setting himself up for a very nice joke there. Me too. I thought he was going to say percussion or some fucking thing. Oh, like no, well, you're, you're, yeah. um, you know, we're like we do your National Front, National Trust stuff. Like a conquer I session? Like a I had a conquer session? Yep. Okay, yeah, fine. I um, think you, you need to have got it ready before we started, I think. I don't no, think... I'm doing now, because Hyman, Hyman will cut all this out. I yeah, suppose. I, I, got, I had concussion at 4pm. Yeah. Sorry, conquer session. <laughs> no, throw right. down. I'm ready to catch it. Yes, I'm ready to catch it. I can't believe this. Okay, key to start. Well, I said oh, key to sorry. Start. That's, that shows you how out of practice. I said start. key to start many oh, minutes ago. Well, I'm going to start with Emma. Oh, the original Emma. And still the best. Mm. Bunton, is it? Radicanu. No more people who, uh, when you stop to think about it, which you should. For just a minute of your fucking life. Hey. Sorry. Whoop. Turn these off in a minute. <laughs> no more people who, when you stop to think about it. For a minute. We didn't know who they were before the great lockdowns of oh. London town. Oh. And now we know exactly who she is. Name another, just for, so we can clarify your category, please, mate. It's got to be. Let's say Chris Whitty. That's probably the way to go with it, yeah. Fantastic. It's 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 actually Jonathan Van Tam. Right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. JVT. Ring the bell, next person. I'm out. Ding, ding. I've probably got a bell. Well, Go got on then. Con. Get your fucking bell. I know you're in Amsterdam. You know you're in Amsterdam. <laughs> I wonder if I was on the bed, whether the lighting would be a bit more... Um... Big if I was on the bed. We are watching, and we've not had one for a while, an in-game relocation. Right, what does go? Oh, that's a point. I've got a prop for this first move as well. Wait one second. It's looking very seductive, Mark. I think I've on record as being a sexy gentleman. He does get a bit, a bit fabulous Baker Boys sometimes when he's rolling around on these beds. I've been looking forward to uh, introducing this character. That I've actually written it um, <laughs> down in this hotel stationery. It is from the Winnie the Pooh books. Ow! 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 It's Ow! No more birdies. Um, when you say no more birdies, is it a bird in the name somewhere? Yeah. Or is it actual well, bird? What I want Hyman to write, or whatever, I want what history books to show is no more well, birdies. Well, you can write it yourself. Well, I can't actually, yeah. yeah. Although it is no more writing, really. I don't think you can write down the category, though, because then you will remember it. I'm not keeping it in sight. Yeah, just Honestly, slightly dangerous more, present. You, you are ludicrous, right. though. You're saying he's got to eat the paper. No, yeah, but can I write down the category, too? No. Oh. Yes, this is what I'm oh. talking about. Eating the paper. This might go wrong. Oh, shit. Have you finished? 
I want to know whether I can ring the bell. It's unbelievable. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Great bell. No more birds in names. Yeah. Give us a country key. You know it's an hour ahead. Yeah, well, that does narrow it down. Is it as simple as Italy? Does it look like an Italian bedroom? Did my face look like an Italian face? Am I shoving ravioli into my trap while I lounge here? Reese Witherspoon. Oh, I was thinking about that earlier. You always do. You, you can't not. You do get a spoon bill, of course. No more cutlery. But ah, I'm including chopsticks. There goes Deborah Chopsticks. And may I ask something, my dearest, dearest friend? Would you classify these things as cutlery of a, of a sort? Cutlery of the body, if you will. No. They're the closest we've got to cutlery on our bodies. I suppose the teeth might have a say in that. <laughs> the teeth might certainly be a bit offended if you said that fingers were better than our eating, yeah? Yeah. Big discussion between feet, fingers, probably fingers, feet and teeth. I think feet are very lucky if they're getting the nod. No, I've just got cutlery including chopsticks. It's not including teeth, feet or fingers. Is it a case of high men putting cutlery brackets, no feet? Not including feet. I'm, I think it's my turn to see what's to, to approach the buffet. I'm going to wander up to the buffet and lift a couple of cloches. Let's put it that way. I love the word cloche. Thanks, Tim. Yeah. And um, I'm going to find underneath uh -huh. one of the um, cloches. Now, wait a second. Wait a second. <laughs> Your hand hesitates over the cloche mid lift. What are you all drinking? White wine, as we know. I'm drinking. Uh, it's, it's lager. <laughs> it's in a tin, and I'm ladling it into my chalice, which which I won at a wedding playing badminton. <laughs> it was in between the service and the sit down meal. So in a way, you had a service, and then you had the service, and then you had the service. Oh what? dear me! I don't want it to be her necessarily. Who is it? Can I have a quick think? You're allowed to think. I'll top this trend oh, up. Oh, this is faith again for the country, if that helps. Yeah. Um, oh, OK. Right. Uh, Belgium. Belgium wasn't exactly the worst thing that's ever come out of your wretched trap. Well, what I can do is I can go for this person and then try and remember the other person. It gives me some time. I think I'm going to go with Richard, Richard Osman. No, I don't know what's going on. Look, I will do that next, but I'm going to go for Penelope Bitstock. <laughs> I mean, in She's some ways, she only became famous during lockdown because of you. <laughs> She's more famous during lockdown than ever before. No more people who are heavily associated. Uh, associated. Can you say it another no, time, but then get further and further away from the actual word? <laughs> with. With, I can do. With is an easy one. You didn't start uh, with well, though. You started with a foot. No more people who, who wear job gloves. Gloves that they wear to do their jobs. I'm going to use this glasses now. Yeah, well, that's it, it is singular, isn't it, glasses? I think I could drink out of that. It's got a candle in it. Oh, but it's very long. It goes all the way down to the bottom. Okay. A lot of things do. This won't make me popular with everyone who's asleep. You never know what they'll go for, the old, um, those polygons down there beneath uh, the... the old, yes, the scruffy polygons. The old PS, yeah, the scruffy polygons, the old SPs. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, yeah. I don't mind this as a vessel at all. Well, well you're, you're telling me to mind my one. I mean, honestly, that would be a great vessel in itself. But the fact that I'm ladling it into a badminton trophy is the, um, well, the icing on the cake, if you like. Bits of wax keep floating up. I found this on a path. Oh. Ah. <laughs> no, I no, the story. no. I finished the story. Oh, I was just going to say I'm behind the story, but if that's it, then... Ah. Well, that's it. Okay. Well, I liked it. I found this on a path. Then I, well, then I picked it up and took it home. Hmm. Neil Young, I think. No more people. Uh, where? <coughs> where? I have quite a bad cough. Since you've done it once in about the last 45 minutes, you've got quite a good cough. <coughs> ah, it's worse, though. Well, or better. Um, a good point. <laughs> yeah, it tells what you like in a cough, doesn't it? No more people who, the, the first, when you think about them, by the way, this is only when you stop and think about them. The first two letters of their name are the first two letters of an American state. What? <laughs> Sorry, did I actually say it in Greek? Is it, what do you mean the NY or the NE? No, it's the NE, the NE, so Nevada for the, in this case. 
Oh dear. Mm. Oh dear. Yes. Yeah, I'm, I'm dead. Yeah, Dad, no. Daddy's dead as well. Well, I'm going to go straight in then with Zippy. Zippy, no more. Hang people. on a minute. Is this people with a, with a first name or second name have got the first two letters? No, no, it's, it's, it's only their first name that's a problem. Zippy, no more people with a funny voice. Uh, name another horn. A uh, Joe Pasquale. Well, I reckon I'll probably go Bungle. And you just wonder how many more of these guys. Bungle well, seems risky to me. <laughs> Does he? I think I know why, yeah. But he's in a very similar world to Zippy. He's not a gel like Zippy. I mean, Zippy's got the most stupid voice I've heard for a long while. Well, yeah, okay, good, good, good. if we are Rainbow, Big if. you're obviously Zippy, Mark. Eh? Am I? So I'm I'm now George? No, Key is Zippy. Key is Zippy. I'm, I'm Bungle, you're George, Mark. Yeah, I'm nice. <laughs> George is really nice. Is Bungle your man? And is he also, think... is he meant to be a bear in real life? And is Zippy a hippo? Is George a hippo as well? Wasn't Andy Circus in Bungle? Also, Alex, you're going for the record for the most questions asked about Rainbow in one minute. I'll go, I, do, I will just go Mr. Bump. <laughs> Mr. Bum? Mr. Bump from the Mr. Men books. Bump. What, what oh, would you challenge if I said Mr. Bump? There's a possible <laughs> challenge, but I don't think that it it would oh. be carried or that it would be fair or that I would come across as a nice, as a decent person. You know, they have all got first names. His first name is Nick. Nick, Nick Bump. Bump. Nick Bump. They have all got first names, that's true. Is he called Nick Bump? Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to go for Mr. Bump. You should definitely go for Nick Bump. Yeah, Nick Bump. No more blue people or no more people who you can find an image of them on, on the internet where they're blue. Uh, well, uh, what I will do, actually, if nobody minds, is just take a little mental check on the categories as they as I understand them so far. Right, Key, okay, do you want to guess what country Mark's in? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'll come off your face. What, what, give, me a, give me something. Oh, I'm going to react to something now. I'm going to react to be, being stung by a bee. Oh, OK, Holland. Yeah, that's done it. Well, I can see why that gave it away, yeah. Oh, it? I thought you were in Denmark. Uh, I think Amsterdam is still in Holland. Oh, I thought you were in Copenhagen. Ah, yeah, OK. <laughs> well, I challenge, I reckon he might have a funny voice. Ah, because there has been a TV version. No, 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 no. Bump doesn't have a funny voice. Let me tell you that for a start. Arthur Lowe does all the voices, and Bump has got a perfectly, you know, straight down the line voice. The, his main thing wasn't his voice. His main thing was... He was a clumsy F-U-C-K. Yeah, the main thing is you, the, the prick was always running into stuff. The P-R-I-C-K was running into stuff. I'll tell you what, I'll go as far as to say the T-W-A-T was running into stuff. He's very blue. i tell you what, you don't expect him to open his mouth and then be sort of particularly RP. So you can see how Mr Bump had his little accidents. Mr Bump had had many jobs, but somehow... They never seem to last very long. Uh, this, honestly, is same, this, this is the same this, thing again. It's more than nine <laughs> sessions, and it's not, and you're just the wrong person doing the work. The yeah. old, uh, you know, squidgy dolphins are going to be absolutely apoplectic about this. I'm going to concede that I don't think he talks. Now, this is where the, you start to get a feeling that there's been a lot of, there's been a few categories now. This is where the rap shit comes in. Grimes. What's Grimes? She's a Canadian pop star, but uh, was also the wife of um... Elon Musk. Yeah, Elon Musk. Uh, yeah, no more people. You can prove they've been in a private jet. It doesn't have to be an image. Maybe it's a news story. You know, you can prove it. Now that one I like. Grimesy, no question about it, because married to that very, very rich fella. Yes, I don't think she's slumming it on the old night buses. Let's put it that way. I don't think she's on the mega. I'll tell you what, you've got a fantastic setup this week, I must say, Mark. You look like a fairly dignified caterpillar. Duncan Goodhue. No more people with a uh, bald patch or more. Have you heard the, uh, you know, the old uh, breaststroke specialist speak recently? Well, you know, in the spirit of, uh, you know, just getting out there and enjoying yourself once in a while. I might like Watto just to sort of, you know, bang him up on YouTube and see you salutes. I'll tell you what, I'll do you a deal. You challenge on that <coughs> and I'll see if I can find the prick on a private jet. Oh, what, is this double challenge? Are you both challenging? Well, let, let's get him talking first, Watto, and, and then I'll and then I'll look for the private jet. Right. I'll use my ninety seconds after. This is fantastic. Oh. Alrighty, alrighty. This is a cooperative. Let's so, coming at me from all sides. Oh, it looks like you've got a dining room chair next to you, but actually, I keep having to remember that it's that weird gong. Now, Duncan Goodie's done a TED talk for a start. Ah. Oh. You know, uh, it's great to be back. 
great to be here. And um, a physiologist. Which one's in? We <laughs> haven't. <laughs> 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 Well, I mean, that's very good, but unfortunately, the guy couldn't have a more normal voice, really. It's good to get a joke, a joke under your belt on the live one, isn't it? Uh, to get a joke on the live one is worth two in the bush. That's fantastic. <laughs> right. Good to you on a private jet. Um, can you tell us about your new book? Well, uh, um, no, 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 no. This is a photo. It's not cattle class, is it, that one? And uh, it says, Duncan Good to you, British Olympic swimmer, Seen here with no, it, I'll tell you what it is. He's, he's gone it, to a museum, that's what happened. It's in the same article, there's a plane and there's Duncan Goodyear. I'll tell you what, we've we've rough torn up something criminal there, but he's he's walked, he's they walked away from all sides. One all one was rattled. It's now my go, and I've got to say, I've heard what you've had to say, and I've enjoyed it so much. Oh, but I, I, I can't been... remember anything, I can't remember who I said that one, let alone. <laughs> <laughs> I think I might go for he who must be obeyed. Ah, shaking Stevens. Jean Claude Van Damme. No, no, the captain of industry himself, Jesus. Well, I don't remember any stories where they say, and lo, he got on a private jet. And lo, Jesus spoke. Hello, would you like some bread? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's blasphemy, basically. Huh? Yeah. Which one's that? That's bad, isn't it? <coughs> I think he's got it. I'm Sorry? worried what has got COVID. What does your drink taste of? Milk. Do you want to see my certificate that I've not got it? I'm going to take a lateral flow. Just to <laughs> see. I'll wait till I've done my go, but I'm, I'm going to go and then flow, I reckon. You're going to flow and join it? I think I'm going to flow and join it. I've spotted a problem with Jesus, amazingly. Very ah. rarely do that. The funny thing is, he is watching, probably, because um, famously... He, he's uh, ev everywhere and nowhere. He's everywhere. He sits at the right hand of the Father on high. I don't know what the problem with him was, and that makes me, that gives me a certain idea. It's given me the hippie Jesus, yeah. I think I'm going to go for Joe Johnson. Is that a runner, Joe Johnson? Sort of, yeah. A, 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 um, he, snooker player. Oh, he, cool. ran, he ran slowly around the table playing snooker. No more people who won a major trophy in the... 1980s. A major sporting trophy. He didn't say that. Right, let's get these pugils shoved down my throat before we're too much older. <laughs> this is the this is the business end when you pull out the old uh, your friend of mine. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lick it, lick it first. <laughs> my flat surface is Daisy May Cooper's autobiography. Fantastic. I've worked with her. She's a she's a phenomenon, quite out of the ordinary. Now, um, what I'm going to do is, I think I need to just angle my screen away because some people feel it's a bit ick. Okay. Was it positive? Well, you won't know yet. But how do you feel positive? Pretty good. Positive sounds... Mm. They should reverse it and say, from now on, look, positive is actually negative because you want to yeah. be negative. So positive is now the new negative. I think there might be quite a lot of problems with that. <laughs> the thing is, I, probably I go Jesus now. I think, I think so. I don't like the way Horn is, like, no. scrunching up his face. Thinking. You're right. You're right to think. You're right to thinking, thinking, thinking. Horn does his thinking, thinking, thinking. Um, I think Horn might have made me stop it with his face. I've got my next one in the chamber. Fucking hell! Look at him. I've got my next one in the chamber. Can you say that uh, once more? I've got my next one in the chamber. Gulliver. Beautiful. And the only thing that stops me from doing that is that I can't do it because it will break one of the categories and I'll be eliminated from the game. So I'm not having God. <laughs> and therefore I go back to Jesus and I hope everything is fine. <laughs> I, would have, I would have challenged on something on Gulliver, but I don't know if it's the same one as your... Oh, don't worry. Gulliver would have, would have had me dead as a dodo. Let's just say Jesus and let's see what happens. Do you know Jesus? You know the guy I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The captain sure. of industry. The captain of industry. No more people who... And, and this is only if you think about them. Never saw a Frisbee. <laughs> well, I'm going to shell on, Jay. It was risky to go for something which you'd backed out of. You must have thought of something. Mm. Well, I did think of something, and it's a, you know, a, a horrible phrase, but Horn, I'd like you to um, do the work on um, finding a blue Jesus. Hey. Eh? <laughs> 
It's difficult because if you type in Blue Jesus, there's hundreds of Blue Jesuses. Well, hang on. That's that's not a good sign, is it? Yeah, but... Oh, I see. What is there? Someone called Blue... Find Jesus depicted yeah. as a blue person. Well, yeah, yeah, I've done that, yeah. Man. That's... More... <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. Bare minimum, man. We're having a discussion. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Horn. Just get your, your best Smurf Christ and let's have a, let's have a chat. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll change my top. You said there are more people who've been depicted as being blue, and that's what that is. So I, I'm on un, I'm on unsteady ground. That's a pretty realistic blue. Yeah. Game. Okay. All right. Now you're talking. Now you're talking. I mean, that's sort of Mr. Bump, isn't it? That's he's getting his bump on there to a large extent. I sort of think you got to uphold the integrity of the game of no more jockeys. I think if I'm challenging on that. And I find a guy that's as blue as that as many times as that, and you don't walk. And if it's you, you maybe you don't walk. Then I, <laughs> maybe, maybe I said maybe. I think the, the the absolute best thing I can do here is walk. And I, for that reason, am accepting the challenge. And I am out. And that is that. Like that's a good challenge. That's good. No more jockeys. That's how it's played. That means we we now play on, Horn, and it's your yeah. go. I, might, I suppose I might do another um, in-game relocation, actually, because uh, that's another one of their things, and it doesn't matter now about the light. Lovely. Oh, desk, desk. Oh, we've been here before, haven't we? Yeah, no, it's not. Well, I could go in the bathroom if you want. I wouldn't mind seeing the old, you know, at least hearing the taps start to um, do what they do best. I suppose I could get in the bathroom, really, in a sort of homage to one of the <laughs> famous No More Jockeys games. Horn, have you, got, have you got someone up your sleeve here? Yeah, I do. Yeah? It feels to me like it's Bouncer. The doggy? Yeah. I'm in the dry bath. Well, put the chilli in your eyes or something. You'd have to be a bit of a dick to do that. I'm sure the old plod squad would be interested in you filling that bath up. <laughs> no more characters with tails. Characters? No more things with tails. No more things with tails. No, no more things with tails, says Horn desperately. I think I might put it inside out for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to challenge. I'm going to go for the, the, the bouncer won an award in the 80s. I have to relocate again to get my, to do the work. If the dog won an award, there's going to be some big discussions about what a major trophy is, unless he's won an Oscar. Well, how's he winning an Oscar? He's a doggy. Well, that's the thing. I think if it's an Australian Animal Acting Award, I'm not sure that'll be major. I've Googled quite a few things like, Soap character of the year, 88. No, we'll try that. His last appearance in Neighbours was the day before my 13th birthday, but that doesn't didn't help. Have you checked whether he won Wimbledon in the 80s? No, I have, yeah, he didn't. Uh, it was mostly people like Boris Becker. Yeah, that's it. Um, I, I'm sorry, I, I, there's there's no evidence, unfortunately, that Bouncer won, a, won anything in the 80s. It was a... a Challenge that bought time. It bought thinking yeah. time for time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's nothing wrong with that. Reggie Cray. You know what yeah. I haven't done tonight? A wee. Yeah, actually, fair play. I've done it older. It now all just comes out of my fingers. I think you look like the bloke from Beautiful South. Yeah, Paul Heaton. No, Jackie Abbott. I am. I'll go Reggie Cray. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No more Europeans. Oh, well, I thought he was... I'm I thinking of Reggie Watts. Oh, that's nice. Well, what Rachel? Rachel? Ah. I like the way that makes me look. Guys. Um, Horn, are you, are you challenging or are you sort of pressing Yeah, I'll on? challenge. I'll challenge. I'm going to go ball patch or more. Yeah. He's, he got to a ripe old age. I think I should have worn these ones throughout because they, they look quite good. <laughs> I've set the timer, but... Um, I mean, I'd look for any sort of going to prison and stuff like that. Well, you think your hair falls out when you go to prison? I mean, I sort of think they slick their hair back and the Kemp's played them, so, you know. Yeah, but I wonder if they slick them back because they had a ball patch. You've got, certainly, pictures where he doesn't have much hair. Why, why well, have you shown a picture where you can't see his hair? It, it was ball patch or above, which we were saying. I, I've seen hairier men in my life. I wouldn't walk on that. It's not a bald patch. I mean, there's also this for your consideration, where I, I mean, oh, that's quite bad. That one. <laughs> that's a high hairline. No, I think I'm. 
ever so slightly frustrated because I think he probably was bald. But if there's no photos to prove it, I, and I did, I did Google Reggie Quay bald. Reggie Quay uh, with a W. Yeah, with a W. Come on, all, let's be having you. Yeah, go too long. Go too long. <sighs> I think he's got it. Yeah, he's got it all right. Look at that. You're not going to see one closer to the sea than that for a long while. I mean, it feels like it's got to be one of our one of our. Up, up you go, guys. No more people we've met. I can't remember Reggie um, Cray's category, but I, I chose to believe that Reggie Cray and Josie Long can't have anything in common. I've got to break oh, yeah. it. Oh yes, I'm out. I've got in common. Yeah. And bye bye, everybody. I completely forgot that one. I think you should formalise the challenge, Tim. Josie Long is European. European. Oh, it's full circle because it takes us back to Watto's European adventure. Watto is in Europe. Tim <laughs> P wins the live game. And Tim, in doing so, ends a run of absolute hell for his supporters. His supporters saw him dominate the fourth set and then it slipped from yeah. his fingers. That was tough for people to watch. Yeah, it was well played. Oh, that's quite good. That's not too bad. It was Joe Johnson's bald patch. Has he got a bald patch? Well, I kind of think all men do. And then my other footnote was why he went on Gulliver. I think you could have said oh. the gull was a bird. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, but I'm so, uh, sorry, I'm so thick. I was thinking I was going to challenge you on liver. Mad, not mad That's stuff. Like the liver birds. What I've learned is that people should take more pictures of the craze from behind. I've learned yeah. that Jesus can be any colour. And and you should listen to the category before you say the next one. It's crosses. It's crosses.